Hello! How you guys doing? Oh my gosh, I'm fantastic. Are you having trouble deciding which side to go on for your gymnastics? Your cartwheel and maybe your back bend kickover, your handstand, your leap? Are you just like, ah, or ah? I don't know which way to go. Okay, well let's do some tests to try and figure it out. So the first thing I want you to do, just go ahead and give me a kick. Just kick your leg. Which leg did you kick with? That's probably, probably going to be the one that you want. Okay, now let's do another test. You're just gonna stand tall, lean forward, and step out of it. Which foot did you use to take your first step? That's probably gonna be the one that's going to be the situation leg. Another thing you can do, take a nice big step for me, bend your leg, this is called a lunge, okay, gymnastics. Go ahead and put your hands down in front of your foot so it makes like a triangle or like a smiley face. These are the eyeballs and this is the nose or the mouth. Then I want you to lift your back leg up. Then I want you to pull your arms up while you keep this leg up. And then put it down into a lunge and bend the front leg. Okay, now try it on your other foot. And I'm gonna do my left side. So I step my foot, lunge, and lunges and levers, these are all great things to practice for your purpose. Put your hands down, strong arms, lift up that back leg, look at your hands, and pull your arms and chest up, and lunge. See which one is easier for you, okay? Then you can add a full lever. Stand tall, big step, reach like a seesaw. As the top goes down, the back leg goes up, play the piano, arms up, and lunge. Try it on your other leg. Lunge, reach. Don't fall onto your hands, play the piano. La, la, la. I played the violin, so piano's not my thing. It's okay. So do that a bunch. See which one's easier for you. Whichever side you're gonna notice feels easier, stick with that side. Although sometimes I've had some kids where they're like, well, they both feel the same. They both feel the same. Actually, try a mini cartwheel, okay? So big step. You can even use something like this where you reach over it. Remember the second hand turns. Just do a little one, landing on the back foot, okay? And try and stand up and then try your other foot. Big step, reach, get that back leg up, hand, hand, foot, foot, hand, hand, foot, foot. Those are small ones. Do those a bunch. Just go easy, go small at first and see which one's easier, which one you can stand up with. Now, if one, if you have your cartwheels pretty good and one's kind of like maybe like this, but then your other side, you can. Do it, but it's more kind of like this. Then you're probably want to get a stick with that first one, the better form, right? Another thing you can do is lay down for your back bend kickover. Oh my gosh, it was freezing when I left, and now it's like I'm a roasting hot tamale. So you can go ahead, put your arms out, just kick your leg. Either one, which one do you want to kick more? Or which one did you do first? Then you can put your hands here, bend one foot to your butt, kick the other one, and then push off this one. Kick and push for your back bend kickover drill. Kick and push, then try the other foot. Kick and push. Which one do you like better? Then you could push up into a bridge and try and lift one leg up. Okay, try your right leg. Remember, turn it out, not in. And then try your other one. Which one floats your boat? Which one do you like better? So once you decide which one feels a little more comfortable, try and stick with that side. Because in gymnastics, you wanna kinda stay on that same leg, on that same side. Because if you do a million cartwheels, you know, to your right, and then all of a sudden you're like, oh, I think I'm gonna switch to the left. It just kinda makes your brain and your muscles go, oh, what are you doing to me? 
You could even do it for a leap. Leap over something. Like try to, try to do it without paying attention so much, kind of like. Which foot did you leap with? That's probably the one. Oh, and you can try baby handstand also. Big step, reach, back leg up. Look at your hands, strong arms, little hop. Stand up. Try it with the other leg. Big step, reach. Which one was easier? So those are all great tests for you to figure it out. Oh, oh, and it doesn't matter what hand you write with. I write with my left. I box. I'm a lefty uh, southpaw uh, boxer. I snowboard left and I do gymnastics right. So it doesn't matter what hand you, you write with, okay? Just put that out of your mind. Okay, everyone, you can check out my channel for uh, so many skills if you wanna learn gymnastics with me. And I got workouts too, because remember, you gotta get strong or you're gonna fall on your face. You can just type in Coach Megan and whatever skill you want, and it'll probably come up. Coach Megan handstand, Coach Megan cartwheel, Coach Megan blah, 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 kip, whatever it is. Okay, thank you so much for joining me. I really appreciate it. Here's your end of the video trick. Until the next time, sayonara.